Hey everyone, Justin here. And uh, sorry for the late upload. I had to free up some space on my phone. Anyways, uh, today we're going to review Super Mario Bros. Game & Watch that just came out November of last year. And, uh, so without further ado, let's get started. So, uh, it's a clock. Okay? Helps you set time. So, the question is, should you buy this thing in 2021? Let's find out. So, there's a lot of secrets. If you press B, then, wait, 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 A, A, B, B, are you supposed to hold B? I think, uh, uh, oh, ground moles appear if you hold B, I think. Wait, wait, that was A. Well, if you hold A, you will access this, the Mario drawing song. Well, isn't that a charming little song? Anyways, let's look at the games. So the games are nothing too special. The first one is Super Mario Bros. And if you hold down A, then you'll get this. The Infinite Lives Code. Well, let me show you another secret. This, that only works for the Game & Watch version. If you try it in any other version of, it, of Super Mario Bros, then it won't work. Only the Game & Watch version. So yeah, this thing has an LCD screen, three games, and stuff. So yeah, if you hold left or right and, pre and hold B, you can unlock the level select. This is really useful if you want to speed run the game. So yeah. Anyways, now this thing comes with a it comes with a built-in charger but with no USB port. Also, the battery life is very poor with only 8 hours. So yeah. So let's look at its sequel, Super Mario Bros. Lost Levels. This is a hard game. If you are you guys are hardcore gamers and play it, beginners play the first game. But the final game we have here is Ball. Now I don't mean to hurt your feelings, Nintendo, but Ball has nothing to do with Mario. So yeah, the goal in the game is to. Let Mario go left or right so the balls won't fall down. So it all comes down to the price. When I got this thing on Amazon, it was $47. But if you, if you got this at GameStop, then the price would be $49.99. That's like a price of a new game. So yeah, is it worth it buying a Super Mario Brothers Game of Watch in 2021? Well, it's a revival of the Game of Watch series from 1980 to 1991. So, it's worth it. It's the least expensive and it keeps you on a tight budget. Anyway, see you guys later. Bye.